See him way underneath too. Yeah, yeah, there's so many. There. There's a baby right there. There's a little baby. Tiny. Oh, <laughs> and something that's really interesting about these dolphins, uh, what they're doing right now, they're actually sleeping. sleep they're conscious breathers so they have to think about taking every breath uh, unlike us we just have to fall asleep all day. Uh, these guys have to think about taking their their breaths so what they do is they get together in pairs and they each turn off half of their brain at a time and uh, by doing that they're pretty much like one dolphin together uh, they're able to rest that inside half uh, they keep that outside side of their brain awake that eye open uh, that way that they can uh, watch out for predators and thinking they're thinking about taking the next breath. And we we see the dolphins quite a bit in the morning time because uh, they're in shallow. They come in shallow to sleep, and then later on in the oh, it's a baby! Did you see the baby? Uh, it's right there. They wake up and they go out into deep water to go feed. Hey, there's the little like that's the little baby is like right over there. <laughs> yeah, you see it like it's run up. <laughs> and uh, another interesting thing about these dolphins too is that they're the only type of dolphins that you'll never see in captivity. Uh, they don't survive tanks. Uh, the ones that you see at Sea Life Park are uh, usually bottlenose dolphins. And uh, uh, they have to train those types of food and they like, jump to tricks. Uh, these are the only type of dolphins that would jump in the field and put their play in the wild. Pacific Missile Range Facility. Uh, it is the most active missile testing site in the U.S. They're doing all kinds of stuff out here. Uh, we'll call the base in a little bit when we get a little bit further up by the launch pad and make sure it's all good to go by. I'm not sure if they're doing anything today. 